Hey guys, we're gonna be unboxing the Air Fanta 3 Pro. This is another device from Adam Wong, and this one's designed for those traveling who want more, uh, like a more powerful KDAR than some of the, like the personal devices. It has on its marketing, it mentions 488 CFM. Again, I would say that it would be good to have this device in a double box. So straight away, we've got the, the filters. So these have a mesh on them, similar to what we saw with the new Fit Tempest, like a metal mesh that you'll keep Let's open these babies up. So they look like, so these, yeah, so Air Fanta filters, that obviously these will need replacing uh, as, as you do it. Pretty good size for four filters on each side, similar to a, like a Corsi box. These are still very, fairly new devices to the market, but it is great to see uh, Adam's really good on, on Twitter. He's really open to feedback. Uh, he seems a very knowledgeable engineer, and so we were just super excited to get a chance to try it out. So here seems to be the base. Like I mentioned, it's not a kit in the normal sense, like the clean air kits or the new kit Tempest, because it is more just you kind of put it together. And so let's have a look. I'm gonna try and attempt to build it live. Is this the bottom or is this the top? Black steel on the outside. Now, if you've watched my channel before, you know I'm not not the best at these <laughs> putting things together. So, apologies to to those who are a lot more kind of handy than me. But I'm assuming the F under thing is upwards. So yeah. I'm also not someone to look at the uh, instructions to. Maybe Rodrigo is going to film <laughs> this a bit quicker so it doesn't look so awkward. Oh my god. Right. Place the bottom of the ground on the desk. Yeah. Insert the four speeds, the fills on the bottom, the black steel net is outwards. Yeah. Bring this uh, Fanta, I assume, is up. Okay, so we've got the filters in. Now we just add these on top. We should be good to go. Okay, we're good. <sighs> ah, right, I've done it. Now it is like, obviously I might have just been made a pig's ear of that and I apologize, uh, but I just wanted to try it. Just, I mean, I, I read the instructions, I think. Um, but it is just tricky getting these final filters to all match up. But now it does seem like it is. So I'm gonna just switch it on. So it does come with its own power supply. Uh, and interestingly, also a uh, ability to adjust the power as well, which is kind of useful, similar to kind of fan speeds on your traditional uh, purifier. So let's... Let's give this a whirl. Like I say, it's not, it's not as, as you can see, I've just built it now. Um, it's not as easy as just taking an air purifier out of a box and switching it on, but it's also nowhere near the level of, uh, you know, putting together that you need to use with like, say, a, a kit, say like the new kit Tempest or something like that. So let's, let's push it on. Let's hopefully, we're good. So we're on, there we go. So this is at four volts, 4.41. It's fairly quiet. All four fans seem to be running. And then we can get it right up to 12.6 watts. Yeah, it's quite a, a cute device actually. Like, it doesn't take up too much space. It's not like a massive like the the CR box. Yeah, I'm excited to see how this one does. So we're going to be testing this device in the same test room we test all of our air purifiers. We're also gonna be testing the sound levels, so we'll probably choose some set different voltages to see, uh, and also test performance at those. So like trying to find a, a level of sound that you're happy with, and also see how much performance it does. Um, yeah, so if you're interested in this device, the four Pro from, Air, sorry, the three Pro from Air Fanta, then be sure to hit like on this video and subscribe to the channel, because we're gonna be releasing our review fairly soon for this device.
Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.